Howdy friends, Kyle here inside the all new, much anticipated Regal LS9. And I couldn't be more excited to finally do a tip to tail walkthrough feature benefit of this amazing new boat. So let's start right up front. And we've got some amazing footage to go along with the amazing boat that I'm in from the drone up above. So I'll start on the outside and then invite you in just a little bit to do a more in-depth deep dive into the cockpit. But as you can see from the outside, they did a great job of building on the LS2, the LS4, and the LS6 platform. A beautiful belt line and running lines on the boat, giving it the typical regal look out on the water. Sexy, sporty, very clean, and very classic. Absolutely love the presence in the water. Starting up front, we've got a windless anchor, and this is incredible. They did a great job of designing something that looks seamless, like it's part of the boat, and also giving you accent to the windless anchor, and then a nice on-off switch here for maintenance. Great job there. The use of stainless steel tastefully is off the charts on this boat. Uh, big oversized cleats here, the nice recessed stainless steel grab handles there that's just enough to give you the safer safety and comfort that you're looking for but also adds a nice bit of curb appeal as well uh, the taylor classic taylor curved windshield here with the stainless steel windshield header both functionally and aesthetically beautiful no blind spots in this particular design one of the other things that i love about this boat and you get a, a great view of it from the air is this hard top. And it's not just any hard top, it is power. Uh, Regal was the first to market with the power tower, the first uh, electric tower that folded down with the touch of a button. And they've built on that legacy with this all new hard top that will fold down for storage or if the boat is staying on a hoist with a canopy, uh, it gives you great flexibility, great coverage from the sun on one of those hot days. It's a very seamless look. So no more frogging around with bimini tops opening and closing them. You get this beautiful, fully functional hard top that at a touch of a button will fold down. Now working a little bit further towards the back of the boat here, uh, you're gonna notice that it has a close to water, oversized swim platform. And this is fantastic. For those days that uh, you're out at the island or anchored at a sandbar, getting in and out of this boat, is super easy. We've also included a power swim platform. So at the touch of a button, this swim platform deploys down into the water, uh, providing you a nice seat in the water to enjoy everything that God's creation has to offer. But I love this swim platform. It's a very inviting uh, piece that says, come sit back here. And as you're gonna see in a moment, when we continue our feature benefit walkthrough, uh, the seats, this aft lounger system is in my opinion the superior uh, design in the industry i don't think there's anything out there that quite compares with the versatility the comfort forward thinking that regal offers in the ls9 okay let's take our deep dive now into the inside of the all new ls9 and again, I want to highlight this swim platform area again, this aft seating, because I think it's really a game changer. And I've looked at everything else out there in the industry, and I don't think there's anything that makes more sense from an ergonomic standpoint. Uh, the center walkthrough with the aft loungers gives you the most storage, the most seating, and the most versatility out of any design that I've seen out there in the bow rider segment. The swim platform is big, it's spacious, it's beam to beam, making entry from a dock very easy and very safe. Again, as I mentioned earlier, low to water means it's easy to get on and off. It's very inviting to swim up next to, easy to get on and off and spend time back here sunning yourself and enjoying the water. But these loungers are great. So if you're entertaining people inside of the cockpit, there's still plenty of seating back here. It's very comfortable. And again, a space you're gonna spend a ton of time. But for those afternoons that you're looking for just a little more leisure, uh, these seat backs uh, fold rear facing and give you the ability to uh, really lounge and enjoy this area to its fullest. 
but I love the versatility here as we move further into the cockpit because that's gonna be a reoccurring theme. As I mentioned, the center walkthrough gives you the most seating and the most storage, but these social seats give you the versatility to uh, entertain depending on who's with you. If you've got just your family and you really wanna spread out, you have the ability to do that. But if you've got another family or maybe two other families, you can really utilize this space and haul lots of people in comfort and style. Again, these social seats give you the ability to forward or reverse seat and you've got lots of cup holders, stainless steel grab handles, speakers everywhere, and LED lights to complement. So I love this interior space. It's expansive, and I can't stress how comfortable it is. It's one of those things that's hard to put into context in a video is how comfortable the seats are. Now, the materials that Regal uses are in part why they're so comfortable. 38 ounce vinyls give you the most durability on the market today. Uh, the triple stitching gives you the longevity and then the beauty. You've got all these contrasting materials, the different color stitching, the quilting. It all comes together nicely and it's sporty yet elegant and again, extremely comfortable. The foam that they use are dual density foam, so you squish down a little bit, but not too far. So it's a comfortable, but not yet uh, so comfortable where you squish down so far and it stretches out the vinyls and stresses those. So this boat is, is really, really comfortable and absolutely beautiful. Okay, a few practical things, things that are gonna really add value to the boat, something you may not be thinking of when looking on the internet or visiting uh, the Regal showroom, uh, but that is storage. Now, Regal's taken a lot of pride over the years in developing storage compartments that are class leading. So Regal has more cubic feet of storage than any of their competitors across the industry. They've worked very hard with their design team to achieve that because they know that families take a lot of gear. There are a lot of things that you can do out on the open water and having good usable storage space can really complement those activities by giving you the storage necessary. Under here we have a nice uh, storage compartment that can double as an additional cooler. I love the thought behind this. It's an insulated cooler that drains down into the bilge so it can be used for dry goods or you could fill it with ice, food, and beverages. Very, very thoughtful. Now let's continue up towards the front because the storage compartments don't end here. Got a big giant scissor style storage compartment. And one of the things I want to point out as well is how big these storage compartments are. Some of our competitors have storage, of course they all have storage, but it's not all usable. It's not all functional like the Regal storage compartments because uh, they're big and expansive. So larger items have plenty of space uh, for those items. More storage here on the side. Of course, you've got a Another place here up front. They did a great job addressing all of your storage needs. The new LS9. All right, let's spend some time here at the helm. I love the design here. Let's start first with this seat. A few years ago when Regal first introduced the social seat, it took some time for our customers to understand the versatility and the value add that this has over a traditional captain's chair. Uh, first, it gives you forward and aft facing seating capabilities, but it also gives you an extra wide chair here for another person. So it's great to share this space, to share in the information, the destination that you're planning to go, and really just get intimate out on the water. Love the seat here. Also has a flip up bolster that works very seamlessly, giving you added visibility over any passengers up in the bow or the extra visibility needed to pull tubers or skiers. But the comfort here is again, hard to put into context through a video. You'll have to come visit us and sit in the seat for yourself. Ergonomically though, they did a great job because uh, the screens are at the perfect height. They got a nice brow here to block some of the sunlight coming in. Uh, you've got a great armrest here for the throttle to feather that perfectly when pulling tubers or skiers. A tilt wheel that's hand stitched with stainless steel spokes and just a very clean design. Notice there are no buttons, right? Used to seeing backlit plastic or stainless steel buttons, but everything is now controlled through digital switching on the dash, making this a 
an, a, a nice experience that's different than anything else Regal has put to market. Uh, cuts down on wiring and chances for having electronic failures. And so, um, again, a very futuristic uh, dash setup here that's clean, inviting, and very easy to use. Okay, let's concentrate on the port side here. The port side co-captain's area here is elegant and very thoughtfully designed. Uh, one of the newest innovations from Regal, in fact, I think they were the first manufacturer to introduce a port side control center here. And so you've got a nine inch touchscreen that allows you access to all the information that the driver has, gauges, charts, stereo. You really have all the information at your fingertips here on the co-captain's side. Now, uh, something all families are looking for in this class of boat, which is a convenient, spacious, easy to get into head. Regal doesn't disappoint here. One of the things I want to point out too is their access. They've always prided themselves on having great access into the head. Can't say so much for some of their competitors. And so getting in and out of this is a real snap thanks to this door that opens up really wide. But again, they did a great job of finishing off everything. The liners, um, the countertop space, even the sink, they use high quality materials, craftsmanship, the finishing touches are exceptional. Here and show you how easy it is to raise and lower the hard top. So I've already undone one of the sides. You pull out, twist it, and then you can grab this side, pull out, and we're going to twist get that all the way it rocks back into that position and then you come up to the dash with the digital switching you just press the button it easily folds down even with the windshield header this is also a great benefit too if you ever got caught in a storm you could fold this down and stay out of the harm's way so now that we have it back up we're gonna rock this, do just the reverse. Easy. I'm gonna spin this back into position. One side's done. And that's it. We've done it. Completed up and down on the all new hardtop Regal LS9. All right, finally, we're in the bow. Now, this is a 29 foot boat, it's nine feet wide and it's just huge it feels so much bigger than the 2800 that it replaces the bow is deep and spacious you got plenty of room to lounge and lay about you got these beautiful armrests that flip down and again the fit and finish is absolutely breathtaking i love what they did up here you got the premium package here with the stainless steel grab handles and then the stainless steel grab handles down here below jl audio system and cup holders again elegant and beautiful now listen for more information about the regal ls9 or to come take your own personal tour of one of these boats get a hold of us the information will be on the screen thank you so much can't wait to see you